Hi Aquarius, it's Al here to do a quick read. So I just felt like I needed to give the Aquarius people, my Aquarius followers, whoever, give them a quick message. It just was in my heart, on my spirit to do so. It's going to be very quick. I've asked the cards, I've asked God, spirit, angels, to give Aquarius a message, a message of encouragement, I'm feeling. Um, some of you need to just be encouraged in whatever you're doing. Okay, so let's see. Thank you, thank you, thank you for telling the Aquarius. She the Aquarius. What's that message that you have for the Aquarius? All right, first card out, Nine of Cups. Nice. All right. It says Aquarius, you feel like you are apart from. You fill in the blank. Make a wish for you to be with whatever it is you fill in the blank. And it can very well come true. Wish fulfillment is here. If you hope, you wish, you pray for it. And know that it will come in. The next card we have is strength and death. Some of you are hoping for something or someone you are without. You're going to have to have strength in order to change. In order to accept the change of this dynamic. Something you're in. Something you're, you're, you're participating in. Something you're creating. It says you don't have to have the strength to walk away. The strength to get out of negative thoughts. The strength to put the work, energy, effort, time on yourself. Examine yourself. Perfect yourself. Perfect your craft. You're going to have to have the strength to um, communicate. Either this is loving communication Rapid communication back and forth. You also have to have the strength to move. Move away from. You have to have the strength to communicate. Maybe about the trouble. In a particular relationship. It will ultimately bring you. The death card. Uh, an ending. Something's been dying for a while. With strength here. Because it's. The devil was probably here also at one point. Uh, or, yeah. Um, know that in having the strength to allow an ending, and this might be an ending of something valuable to you. It could be friendship, marriage, job, career, home. Or complete transformation of some of you are transforming into the person, the person you want to be. And it's hard, but you wish, you hope for this. Cards that you, you hope for this, you wish for this. It wasn't going to come in the manner that you thought it was going to come wrapped up in a bow, in a box, in a bow. It came with ending. Separation, needing to be strong. The Queen of Swords. You've been through a lot. This is the divorcee. This is the... She's very logical, very smart, intellectual. She takes the advice of people around her. She's grounded and she's intellectual. And she, she's a constant learner. You know, uh, of ex learner from experience. Um life experience and just dealing with people she says if I have the capacity to be wrong so do, so do the people around me or vice versa if the people around me are wrong then I have the capacity to be wrong also this is a person in need of or who is giving sound truthful advice 
after this this transformation this is a this is a woman who some of you are, are really trying to get into work that is more in service of people like you're servicing the people you're giving truth and accuracy in your words the cards say be strong in this transformation because it, it's not looking how you want it to look you know it's not going how you you pictured it how you dreamed it would go yeah the eight of wands but there's a lot of repetition and, and rapid rapid fire is what i just heard a lot of communication back and forth emails this is um communication that is not face to face so i don't know if in your work or if you're you're dating online or you are communicating with someone who you may be estranged from you guys are not seeing each other on a day-to-day -day basis and you definitely are not communicating face to face it could be in work some of you um you're traveling to see somebody to talk to someone five of cups This is a person who is crying over what was and not looking at what is. I had the cushy life, the job, the money, the this, and now what do I have? I feel like I'm without. I feel like I am experiencing lack in my emotional state. But I'm also not turning around and looking that there's something that marries my soul that is mutually beneficial to me. Turn around and see. This is also a person who's hesitating before making a decision. A decision is to cut away. Making a decision with something you've done for a long time, or a, a marriage, or a long-standing relationship. Making, hesitating before making that decision. Somebody you don't see every day. Somebody is, you happen to be strong for them. They happen to be strong. This might be a person behind bars. Two of swords. Um, not two of swords, two of cups. Crying over the spilled milk. It's done. It's over. You have something here that you can embark on. For some Aquarius, this is love. For some Aquarius, this is career, life path. And it's really messing with the Aquarius because it is not... The, I'm, I'm surprised I haven't seen the moon. It doesn't look like it's working out. It doesn't feel like it's working out it doesn't the Aquarius can't quantify it can't rationalize it and logically put it together so it's it's a, the Aquarius wow ace of cups the Aquarius is at a place of um, the circular negative thoughts the eight of swords governing the strength card Needing to be strong and knowing that this is what you're supposed to be doing. Or this, or if for some of you, if it's marriage. Because we have the death card here and it's in the present. That's the loss of. The loss of something valuable. But you knew you were losing it. The death card isn't the tower card. It's not all of a sudden I'm losing my marriage. No, you knew this was over. You hung in there. You were hanging in. And the death card had to come and rip it from your the grips. You had it on. You had it in. Um, the two of cups, the ace of cups. Some of you may be like you're in service to other people. You're embarking on something that is mutually beneficial to you and then to the other person. It could be hand-to-hand -hand commerce or e-commerce or the exchange of 
uh, and it, it marries you perfectly. Then I say on a soul level, we got the Ace of Cups today in the overall energy. This is the new start. Blessed, blessed by the heavens. It's inspirational and spiritual um, clarity in the beginning of. For some of you, it is that you are the hermit card. You're really reflecting right now. You really separate it from a lot of energy that would deflect or distract you from. Let's see what's behind us. Wow. Wow. Wow, Aquarius. Yeah. Okay. Aquarius, for some of you, it's... um. Something's shaping up. Something is shaping up. Hmm. Look. Something is shaping up. And the uh, Knight of Swords. This is, for some of you, this is career. Life path career. You're now on the right path by way of leaving an old way, an old world in behind and going to another one. And growth. It's just growth. Spiritual growth. The wands are about things growing. Spirit and they're about the wands are about spirit and magic and making things happen. For some of you This is, your life path is in being in service of others. Now, and it, it could be in a holistic sense. It could be in a medical sense. Uh, but it's definitely, this is life path. This is somebody in authority. You got two aces here. When you got two, eight, two or more aces, this is someone who's going to be in authority or, yeah, in authority, like I-N, in authority, or A-N, in authority figure. You know, someone who gives good advice. Someone who people come to speak with to gain clarity in knowledge of which way to go the water bearer but at this point the light shedder Ooh, the light sh yeah aquarius is the light shedder aquarius sheds the light on what how some people will, may feel like they're in the dark okay this is your word of encouragement um Aquarius, what is due to you is coming. If you've put out good, you get good. I've always say this with justice and with the will of fortune. The will is always turning. Justice is um, it's like when people say karma has GPS. That's justice. Will of fortune is always turning. You can it could be good, it could be bad, it could be um, you know. What what you feel was wrong in your life, or if you felt slighted, it will now be. The scales will be balanced. Things will be just and fair for the Aquarius. It looks like the heaven rewards the Aquarius. Nice. Aquarius, I'm going to pull one angel answers card and get on out of here. This is 14 minutes. For some of you, this is definitely career. For some of you, it's career, career and like a long-standing relationship, marriage, or something valuable. 
um, the friendship. It may be the ending or the transformation of the Aquarius is is transforming. Is that definitely um, is coming into that butterfly effect here. Um, things are all over the place for the Aquarius, in which it makes it makes the Aquarius feel as if no need to worry, and it's up to you. No need to worry. It's up to you. It's up to you. What do you want to do? You can take to this. Listen to your intuition. Bottom of the, so you can take to this situation. Or you can... Um, there's no need to worry here. And the Aquarius is very worried with the Eight of Swords. It didn't we didn't see it but that that strength card the, the Aquarius is worried blessings from the heaven from the heavens are here is here new love uh, marriage the letting go of one cycle going into another Okay, Aquarius, if you feel like it's resonated with you, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Um, request your own personal reading. Send me an email. You must be an Aquarius person. Send me an email. Uh, I'll, I'll do something special for you if you want um, a 20-minute video sent to you. I'll, a discounted price, okay? I won't disclose it now. Just send me the email if, if you're serious about Get it, gaining some clarity on um, which way to go. All right. Thank you, Aquarius. Take care. Um, remember to stay in prayer. I am praying for you. Pray for me as well. Bye for now.